everyone. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. This channel is a perfect blend of music and sports to learn guitar and tennis with us. In today's video, we are going to cover the second most used or most important ground stroke, that is the backhand. So there are two types of backhand, one-handed and two-handed. In this video, we are going to learn the two-handed backhand. Now, because it is a two-handed backhand, you will have many choices about your whole swing, about your grip. So you can try out all of them and choose one of them. So let us start with the grip. Now, for the grip, your dominant hand will be at the bottom and your non-dominant hand will be on the top. So, I being a righty, I'll use my right hand below and my left hand above. All you need to do is your right hand should be in a continental grip. So, continental grip, that means your palm heel is on one and your index finger, bottom knuckle is on two. Now, let's come back to the non-dominant hand. This time, you need to use a semi-western grip that, uh, for the left hand or the non-dominant hand. This time, your palm heel is on seven and your bottom knuckle of the index finger is on eight and you close it. Now we have covered the grip. Now let's see how do you get into the ready position and how you take your uh, racket back. So ready position, same as forehand. You stand um, in an open stance position and then hold your grip in front of you, like this. And then you move your racket back. And this time you have three options to move your racket back. Number one, you can directly take it back like this, parallel to your body, or you can just move it a bit upwards and then drop it down. Three, you can take it a whole loop and then drop it down. Now, how do you stand, right? Low, or how do you move when the ball comes to you? So you take your racket back in any way you wish. And when you take your racket back, move your left leg with your racket like this towards the ball and then your right leg forward and shift all of your weight on the right leg and then drop your racket a bit down. And dropping, I don't mean you drop it this way. Keep the racket face in the same way, just get its level a bit down. Now let's check out your contact point, which means how do you contact and where do you contact. For that, you already know, take your racket back, drop it a bit down, and this time make sure that your racket is just below the ball. And when the ball comes, you brush it up and take your racket upwards. So it should be a low to high moment, okay? So you low, brush up your ball and high. Now, why to brush up, right? Brush up will give you a spin on the ball and it would go dropping into the opponent's court. So spin like this. Now, after the contact point, you have follow through. Now let's take a look at that as well. So contact brush it up and this time you're flipping your racket a bit so your uh, racket face is like this right now but then after you hit your racket face just tilts a bit and then when you follow through keep your racket face the same way off the way it was after hitting the ball and make sure that you have your racket above your shoulder over here now we know all the parts of the backhand now let's just take it quick and Take the look at the whole full swing. So, ready? Move your left leg with your back swing. Shift your weight to the right leg. Brush up the ball. Tilt your racket. And follow through till your shoulder. So, in one go. Now, let's see a few balls. I'll hit a few balls and just see how do I hit it. So whenever you move, make sure that you are moving with your right leg. So take your left leg with the racket and then move your right leg forward and then hit the ball. Don't just keep your right leg there or else you will open up in the wrong direction of the court. Okay. Good one.
Okay. Now I hope that you are clear with the basics of a two-handed backhand. We start with the two-handed backhand because that's easier for the people who are the players who are starting. So just start with the two-handed backhand and we'll get a video for one-handed backhand soon. So as I told you in the starting as well, you have different choices in two-handed backhand. Try all of them. So let's meet in our next video with some more exciting topics. Until we meet again, stay, stay safe. safe.